Police have arrested the man accused in the rape of a young woman jogging in Central Park. The 25 year old suspect is expected to be arraigned in Manhattan criminal court tonight. CBS 2's Natalie Dudrich has more. Polly Velez remained silent as he was led out of the 5th Precinct in Chinatown this morning. The Manhattan District Attorney's Office says Velez, who is homeless, was arrested at 1 a.m. Saturday and now faces several charges, including rape, robbery, and strangulation. This woman who frequents the park says she's relieved the suspect was caught, but is still cautious. I feel a lot more safer, and I'm sure there's a lot more of them out there, um, but we just got to be aware at all times. On Thursday, just after 7 a.m., police say a 27 year old woman was jogging on the footpath near Swan Lake, not far from Busy Center Drive, when she was attacked and put in a chokehold, causing her to lose consciousness, then sexually assaulted. She was taken to the hospital in stable condition. This woman visits the park daily with her dog and says now she'll be more careful. Definitely, like, I have, like, certain areas I avoid, like the tunnels, like, all the tunnels are, like, just a no-go, and um, anywhere that looks a bit dark and shady. There are no surveillance cameras in the interior of the park, but police used cameras on the perimeter to get a clear image of the suspect and trace his steps to a subway station, then to a store, and outside of a smoke shop on 8th Avenue. Investigators say it was a Crime Stoppers tip that led them to Velez's whereabouts. They arrested him overnight in Lower Manhattan. According to police data, this was the sixth rape reported in Central Park this year, compared to two by this time in 2020. The NYPD says it has increased patrols in Central Park. Natalie Dudridge, CBS 2 News.